Hi guys, welcome to my channel. My channel name is here Physics Physics underscore Mountain. Suppose if you are not getting here, then you have to type here Smart Physics Seven X Six. This is my channel, guys. I request you to all members please like, share, and subscribe my channel. Okay, now. Now I am going to take here in 80 chapter oscillation chapter most important four mark questions. We are having here two most important questions in that question. See, in that question we are taking first one. What is the given in that question? That means obtain an expression for the frequency of oscillation of spring of force constant. So, what is the question? It can be called so I mean, that is the force constant of a spring force constant of a spring ok guys and now see here where it is possible to which a mass is attached ok and solution of the for this question answer is see here same as it is like a simple pendulum see here guys let us consider we are taking here let us consider a spring is it is attached from a rigid support. A spring is attached at the rigid support. The given mass, the given mass which is at, attached at the free end of the spring, free end of the spring, that mass is m. Whenever we have attached here, the weight of the body can be worked downward direction. That is mg. Okay, that is mg. And again. <coughs> See here guys, when we hold this object, pull down, pull down as the displacement is y, pull down as the displacement is y, okay, hold the object, pull down as the displacement y, this object we have to release, it can be doing oscillation up and down, okay guys, it can be doing your oscillations up and down, then see here, when we are applying the force here to pull down, okay, the restoring force it will be work along the string upward direction. So here for applied force and restoring force both are in opposite direction. So we are going to take here first of all see that is the restoring force is developed in the string. Okay, the restoring force is developed in the string that is f is directly proportional to the displacement in opposite direction f is directly proportional to the displacement that is displacement is y in opposite direction okay now see here and again whenever you have to remove the proportionality you will get one constant what is the constant I mean that is k okay minus k into y where k is a proportionality constant the constant name is force constant of a spring force constant of a spring but according to the newton second law but according to the newton second law f is equals to ma f is equals to ma so replace of f we have to write here ma then m a is equals to minus k into y then again a is equals to minus k by m into y minus k by m into y for the equation number 1 ok guys and next one for this equation means above equation above equation comparing with Comparing with simple harmonic motion equation. What is that equation? So means a is equals to minus omega square y. Okay, guys. So this is the equation number two. Now equate the equation one and equation two. So equation one is equals to equation two. So then we can write here minus k by m. Sorry, minus omega square y 
minus omega square y is equal to minus of k by m into y. Here y y cancel the both this. Both displacements are cancelled and minus minus also cancelled. You will get here omega square is equal to k by m, then omega is equal to under root of k by m. This is the omega value, but we have to require here. What is that, sir? We have to find out here frequency, frequency of oscillation. So, first of all, we have to find out here time period. What is the time period? But the time period t is equal to 2 pi by omega. Then again, t is equal to 2 pi by here omega value is under root of k by m. We have to write it less omega. So under root of k by m. Again, t is equal to 2 pi. This value we can write as a numerator. It will become under root of m by k. This is the time period formula. Okay, guys. But he is asking frequency. So what is the frequency sir means? But the frequency 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 n is equal to 1 by t means the reciprocal of time period is known as here frequency. So we can write here n is equal to 1 by t value is 2 pi under root of m by k. Then again we can write n is equal to 1 by 2 pi under root of this numerator value if we can take and go as a numerator so, sorry this denominator value if we can take and go as a numerator then it will become under root of k by m this is the required formula this is the required frequency formula this is the most important for the 4 mark question he asked in the previous uh, final exam ok guys once again you can check this one And we are having here another one four mark question. What is that four mark question, sir? Means we are having another one four mark question. That question is what is simple harmonic motion? Give any two examples or three examples. Okay, we are having so many examples for that question. See here, guys. See. First of all, what is the given question here? What is, what is simple harmonic motion? This is another one question, four mark question. Okay? What is simple harmonic motion? Give examples. Give examples. Give examples. This is our question, sir. See here, already I told you in the LAQ what is a simple harmonic motion. Now, once again, also I will tell. See here, answer simple harmonic motion. What is a simple harmonic motion, sir? Means the periodic motion in which a particle, the periodic motion in which a particle which is moved to and fro, to and fro. Okay, two means forward, forward and fro means nothing but backward. Okay, when a particle can be moved in a to and fro about a fixed point such that this acceleration is, its acceleration is always directly proportional to the displacement in opposite direction. Okay, a periodic motion in which a particle move to and fro about a fixed point such that this acceleration is always directly proportional to the displacement in opposite direction that is called here simple harmonic motion why we are taking here negative sir means here acceleration and displacement both are always both are opposite to each other ok guys and next one whenever we have to write a is directly proportional to minus then again whenever you have to remove the proportionality you will get one constant that constant is here minus omega square x omega square x okay this is a simple harmonic motion and examples are examples are first example is force force constant of a spring loaded spring okay force constant of a force constant of a loaded spring 
loaded spring and second example is oscillations of a liquid in u tube u shape of the tube okay oscillation of a liquid oscillations of liquid in u shape of the tube u tubes okay and next one third one oscillations of a simple pendulum oscillations of a simple pendulum and another one also is there fourth one oscillations of a i mean the particle which is rotate in a uniform circular motion so it can be doing here oscillations along the vertical direction along the y axis okay another one example also we can write it is possible to write okay this is a another one four mark question okay guys already i told you in that in that chapter we are having another two questions i mean uh, two mark questions what is the second pendulum and another one is what is the second pendulum and another one is can a simple pendulum be used in artificial satellite that question also this is the most important four mark questions in this chapter okay guys definitely i hope you all are understanding i request you to all members please like and share subscribe my channel okay thank you guys